Hey guys, it's Todd from Mountain 66 Diecast. How is everybody? Hope everybody's all right. Um, <coughs> oh, pardon me. Uh, I did, I meant to do this video the other day, but this got pushed back. I did pick up four Matchbox. Now this I already have. This is a, hang on a second. Okay, there it is now sitting in there properly. 36 Ford. I like this, but I did pick another one up. I'm not sure my buddy's got this or not. I already opened mine, so I'm not going to open that now, my friends, because it really doesn't make any sense. Alrighty, I did pick up another one. Now, again, this is what this is a 19 Audi TTRS coupe. It's pretty interesting. I'm going to open this. Some of these cars with Matchbox, I like the detail of them. Now, the wheels, I'm not... I mean, that's pretty much one of their standard mainline uh, wheels now, and it doesn't look good on this one, but the detailing of the car, and that's pretty pretty good, uh, I think, anyway. I mean, again, it's an Audi. I'm not... I do have to broaden my thing, so I do have some European cars and stuff and that, imports and stuff in my collection. But again, it's not a big big section of it but and and some cars i do I, I do like the looks of and then you know others i bypass because i just don't like them at all Alrighty, my friend now what do we got here i can't even uh oh it's a 20 looks like a 2015 mercedes mercedes this is a weird package it's a weird package I don't know if I'm going to open this. I might leave this. I'm not sure on this. This is a weird looking package. Yeah, it's a 2015. Nothing real special about this package, but something tells me I'm not going to open this. I'm not sure. Unless you guys know, why is that package totally different like that? Or is that just something just to enhance the vehicle? I don't know. It, it, I mean... I'm going to have to, if you got any of you know, let me know. I'm not sure. I don't understand. <coughs> this is, it's totally different than normal, so I'm not going to open that. But I am going to open, <coughs> I am going to open the last one here, my friend. Now we have a 2012 BMW 3 Series Touring. I have to say I like this. This was the only one on the peg. And... I picked these up at Walmart. There was nothing there, so I'm going to open this. There, it, 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 there, was, uh, there was a couple of M2s now I regret. I kind of walked. I had one in my hand. I put it back. It was a 57 Chrysler. Uh, and I got these four Hot Wheels, but I kind of... I still had to get some other things and that, so I kind of put the M2s... In, back i kept these four so now i regret i should have went back to get that 57 i shouldn't have never parted with that and there was another one there i was after it was like a charger i think but oh well it ain't the end of the world but i thought this was still cool so i mean i know like uh, some of you guys are always doing battling and i'm you know again storage and and and, and display room and i'm running out of so uh yeah it, it's a collection that never stops right so but anyway guys well i think this is i think this is pretty cool i think this is this kind of got a well, this is like a blacked out uh car it's, i guess it's, you know, it is pretty sweet i think it does have a kind of a yeah i like it it's just all blacked out different this is different for i mean usually you see the blacked out Cars and that are the ones I have anyway, are usually, well, they're usually Johnny Lightning or whatever, but, you know, they're obviously the older cars, so it's kind of neat to see this just all decked out in the black like this, so. Guys, I hope you enjoyed checking these out. I am going to kind of sign off here. Hope you enjoyed checking these out. I always enjoy sharing them with you. You guys know that. Uh, like, comment, or subscribe, and uh, keep hunting out there, my friends, and, uh, you know, we'll see you soon, and uh, thank you for watching.